Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to install Blues OS inside VirtualBox. So let's get started. First, open up VirtualBox. And then click on New to create a new virtual machine. Now, name it. I'm just going to name it Bliss OS Tutorial or machine folder that this is where our virtual machine is going to be stored. I usually do them in the default directory, but you can change it. Under type, select other and our version, so other unknown 64 bit. And click on next. For memory, you need at least one gigabyte for Android, but I'm going to just spice it up to one and a half gigabyte. I think that will be enough and I'll just click on next so and virtual hard disk so I'll create a virtual hard disk now and for the size I'm gonna set it at 10 gigabytes and click on next and finish and now we can power on our virtual machine but first you need to change on some settings before you power them on first under display change the graphic driver to VBOX SVGA and under storage, make sure you hit this empty disk. Go to choose, choose a disk file. Go to your downloads folder or wherever you have your Bliss OS 11 ISO downloaded. I just have it in my downloads folder. Now we're going to start up our virtual machine. We just enter upscale mode. And it's not good from the live CD do and advanced options and do an auto installation auto install to specified hard disk and ha you have chosen to run the auto install oh, and these annoying pop-ups I really hate using VirtualBox 7 and I should downgrade to VirtualBox 6.1 but I just don't feel like doing it now because I have a bunch of VMs in my VirtualBox 7 if I downgrade and delete VirtualBox 7 it will delete all my virtual machines if you have if you have maybe a suggestion on how can I downgrade VirtualBox without having to remove my virtual machines, but make sure you leave it down in the comments. But for now I'm just going to always close out these annoying pop-ups. And now it says Bliss OS situation is successful. Now click on one Bliss OS. Let's say console and now we're booting into Bliss OS. Let's just wait for it to finish booting. Sometimes, I don't know why the first boot takes this long. There we go, the boot is complete. Now we can detach, first capture our mouse inside the VM. First. Remove all these two bit pop ups, notifications, however, you want to call them. Now we are going to unlock it. It's going to ask us which launcher we want to use. We can either, for this purposes, the most commonly used one, we're going to be using the default launcher that comes with every Android computer, the Android PC, Android phone, I'm sorry. Yeah, it's pretty familiar. If you ever use Android, it's pretty familiar. You can maybe change the desktop background. Not the desktop background, the background. I'm so used to saying stuff about... Oh, you have even have screen server, but maybe we can go into the launcher setting and from there change it. So let's go to this default launcher setting. Is there maybe somewhere? Yep, team. Icon pack. System icons. You can't get more. Yeah. The customization option just, but I'll, I think I'll just use stuck, stick with desktop mode. 
I'll just have to use this tab mode, but yeah, that's pretty much how to install Blissowis inside VirtualBox. So if you found this video useful, make sure you comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Bye!